What's going on guys? Today I'm doing like totally, totally different from what I'm usually doing. So I'm just going fishing for like three hours. It's springtime. I am hoping the largemouth are going to eat a frog. This is a striking frog. Rod of choice, 7.3 heavy, FX custom rods, 40 pound braid, and yeah, we're just frog fishing. I don't even need my fish finder for today, I don't think. I mean, if I'm not catching anything, I'll, I'll see what the temps are, but I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure, like, I'll probably catch a fish or two, very shallow on a frog, so. Let's get it done. Drag is tight. Have not caught a topwater fish of this year so far. So hopefully today's the day. It's cloudy and windy, so I might I don't even have my black pack with me. There's nothing here, so my two rods are just sticking out. So I just brought like one box of top water and frogs. So, I don't know, it's kind of cloudy and windy. So, maybe in five minutes if we're not catching anything, we're gonna switch to a popping frog, like a black popping frog. But we're gonna keep, on, keep our eyes open on a shallow fish. Okay, that's the cast right there. Okay, let's see. Right in a slop. There's bait fish jumping around it. Ooh, there's, a, there's a doe right there. This place is awesome. Now, if you're watching this video, I probably got at least one fish so far. I mean, sometime in this video. So, why don't you put a comment below on, on your guess on how many fish I'm gonna catch today? Yep, water temp 67. Lots of bluegill here. Just lots of different size too. And there's a bass right there. That's the best. It's a little one. Okay. Ooh, now I see fish. Native watercraft, thank you. Thank you for making a stable kayak so I can stand on the seat. Wow, there's a giant bluegill. It's like nine inches. So, so far I saw two bass, probably on beds, but they saw me and they ran away. I'm not gonna spend time trying to catch them because they were like a pound. 14 inches. Oh, there's one more. That one's a decent one. 15 inch. Ooh, there's a cup right there. 
Let's scare him. <laughs> so, what I'm thinking, I need to change my frog to something more obnoxious. I have my top water frogs mixed with my spooks. So, tackle sprinkler frog is my choice because I can cover a little bit more water faster and it's very obnoxious. So if the fish are hung angry, they're gonna smash it. Okay. Oh yeah. By the way, if this reel is kind of noisy, that's because it is. Now, if there are fish like off the bank in this grass here, I think they should be more aggressive. At least more than those at the bank. They're actually kind of skittish. Water temp up to 80. Uh, I mean, silent. Oh, I wasn't paying attention. See, I was not paying attention. That's what happens when you're not paying attention. Oh, there's a pike. <laughs> That's why. There's a little pike. <laughs> You're not gonna take my frog. There's a definite inside edge and outside edge. And so far, I don't know what there are. I'm fishing the inside because it's shallow. Shed bite. Could have been a bluegill. Holy moly, that's a uh, bass, two bass, a female and a male. Just look at it. I don't see the fish anymore. Well, I do now. And it sees me. Nice. Nah, I just spooked all of them here. I promise you're gonna catch something. It's just way more fun to see them first. There's a 
spike. Well, that's a rock here. I wonder if you guys can see. Oh, there's a perch. Nice fat perch. And a small moth. Yeah, that's a small moth. Pretty cool. Yes. Oh, that's a that's a boat flip. <laughs> okay, we did not skunk. We got him pretty good. Oh, we definitely got him pretty good. Look at this guy. He's not a huge one, so we're not taking a picture. Yep, 1575. Okay. Just hit the cam camera three times. Finally, that gets your blood pumping. Even when it's a little fish like that. Backflip. destroyed the frog it's a little one probably even smaller than the last one we're still looking for a big one but we got two fish on the board so if you said two so far you're winning oh. very shallow very shallow my tail is gone, so this one is sinking too much too, so I can't really fish it slow. Oh, I think that was a pike though. <laughs> Just jumped out of the water and of course missed the frog.
just the rock bass. Just bed fishing on the back of my tights and no big deal. <laughs> Would be pretty cool if I just caught a fish right here. <laughs> Man, I feel so safe standing here too. That's kind of crazy. Imagine taking the seat out, put a trolling motor, a bow mounted trolling motor at the front. That's game over. You don't need the seat. I mean, I don't have any control of my kayak right now. But I feel so safe standing here. There is a bass right there. Probably like a three and a half pounder. But, I don't know. I don't think, I'm not very good at side fishing. It's a large mouth. So long as I'm staying in position and I can see my line. And I just dead stick the tank right on the bed. I should be okay. But see, my kayak is moving. I have like a power pole. It means it's kind of pointless that I'm just standing in the back of my kayak. But it just feels so good for doing it. So I just keep, I'll keep standing here. Come on. Okay, I want to check out a couple more spots. I have like three hours today. So you kind of want to slow down. But I also want to fish fast so I can cover the most water. I guess finding the balance is the key. How best? Let's see. I can catch it with the wacky rig. <laughs> I don't know. I think it's biting. It's opening its mouth. I catch him I'm probably gonna fall in the water so that's gonna be a fun video such a better point of view when standing on my seat come on fish it's not a big one I want to catch it off it was a decent one <laughs> I did not I did not fall in the water I don't think the fish is gonna bite it again that was pretty cool though I tricked it to bite with the Senko just gotta keep casting at it and don't move it as much let's see the fish still here probably not no it's not interested anymore too smart or is it yeah don't think it's gonna bite again okay I think this is pretty much over I need to go home the Sun is setting down but basically I hope you enjoy this one I think I got two fish two large mouth that landed one got off and one rock bass so whoever said two Ding, 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 you're the winner. You win 
a thumbs up for me. So, if you guys enjoyed this video, just let me know in the comments. I don't often do this kind of stuff, but this is pretty easy. I just turn the camera on and go fishing. And just enjoy myself. So, if you're new, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Later!